Hey guys, Elizabeth here, Dandy Soap Channel, and I have a mother and child project for you as a Christmas gift. Everyone does the textile, towel, guardian, or kitchen angel, and what we're going to do is we're going to do a mother and child. You will need three rubber bands, you'll need two pot holders, you'll need a kitchen towel, and a washcloth. Also, you'll need some ribbon to match. Now, all of these items came from the Dollar Tree. So, we're going to make our accessories first. First of all, take one of the pot holders. Gather it up. And when you gather this together, and I just take and I just press them just like that. You want one half coming forward. You want the other half going backward. And it doesn't have to be perfect. Just one forward and one backward. Go ahead and put your rubber band on that. And make it just snug as a bug. Lay it aside. Your next one you're going to leave whole. Lay it aside. Your washcloth, you want to lay it out. Make sure you remove all your tags, guys. This looks like the better corner. And you're going to roll it corner to corner. Just roll it up. Don't go tight here. Just corner to corner. Make it kind of snug in the middle, but leave these real loose. Lay that aside. Now, get your towel. And usually it's tri-folded when you purchase them. But we want to make sure that our print is centered. So, lay it out. And you do want to tri-fold it, but make sure that your print is more centered. It's at the half point. Halfway in between. See where I'm laying my hand? That's the half point between here and here. Half the point. Three quarters of a length, whichever you want to call it. And I want to fold that up to my hand. So I know a lot of times that if part of that print is showing, I've got it right where I want it. Because usually the tail is going to meet up with the verbiage. And so usually... Now, you've got that part done. Now, get your arms back down. Raise up your towel. And you're going to place that midways up here. So, right there is where we folded it. And we want it midways. Everybody see that? We want it midways. I want to go ahead and gather this section. But when you gather it, just be mindful of your verbiage. You want your verbiage to show on your dress. This is from your mama, or this is your mama, and you want her dress to show. And that's where you're going to take your first rubber band and just try to get it all going there. And I'm only going to do three rounds, and you'll understand why here shortly. And now we're going to take and gather here, because this is her head. And this does not have to be tight. Once again, this does not have to be tight. And put another rubber band. I only do about three rounds. And you'll understand here real good, because we're going to be tucking that bonnet in. All right. There's the mother's head. Now, take your fingers and push her head out. Fluff it up and take the uh, sides here. And you can bring them down if you want. Or you can kind of flip them under. You'll know how to work it once you get to this part. So just turn it down. And whenever you lay her in your hand, you can kind of do a, a little eyeballing 
and at midway of that pot holder you want to hit right here at the neck so make sure you hold to that what you're going to do is flip her around take the corner of the pot holder see that the corner of the pot holder and tuck it behind her arm into the rear there that's why you don't want that rubber band super tight see how i'm putting that corner in there shaking and trembling but the truth is i'm having to push a lot harder <laughs> than what you will if you, unless you have nerve damage in your hands okay now see we've got her bonnet and you can round out her head if you want to you can fluff it up make it more full looking as you know when you get to this point you'll know what you want to do and if you want it to be more full then you just tuck those corners or the sides rather in a little bit deeper bring back the one that you gathered this is the baby this is mama and baby And you're just going to place it right there at her waist. Bring her arm around and bring this arm around. And the way that I do this, you can put, use a ribbon or whatever, but I take that tail because it's long, tuck it and hold to this one while you're doing that. And you're going to bring it around to the back of baby. And then there you go mama and baby and if you want to you can take a piece of ribbon and tie around mama's neck so that her bonnet stays downward um or whichever you want to do fluff out the head either way it's going to cover up those rubber bands um it's not going to be seen between the baby and the bonnet uh, no one's going to notice it and then it, you may have matching rubber bands you may have rubber bands that match the the towels that you are doing better and there you go so thank you for coming along for the ride i hope you guys enjoyed the mama and baby towel set and if you want to you can just kind of keep shaping her to where it really shows off her dress and take your time with this one that i got from dollar tree and these were you know the blessings and uh so thank you for coming along for the ride. This is Elizabeth uh, signing off with Danny Soap. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, check that little red button right there beside that bell and subscribe to the channel. Please pin this on Pinterest and share it on all your social media, including Instagram. Come over and join our Facebook and always visit the website at dandysoap.com. Until the next DIY, you guys have a dandy, crafty, Hey.